Drive by a gas station and see a great price. Well, at least a great price for these days. You pull in, fill up, and then you get a nasty surprise. You've just paid a lot more per gallon than you expected because you used plastic. CBS 8 Steve Price looks into this gas station tactic that many say is straight up misleading. A lot of gas stations charge people more when they use a credit card. And customers understand because the stations do have to pay a fee when these are used. But how much is too much? This station here is charging an extra 40 cents a gallon. The big sign in front, the one in the landscaping, and the one up high, all showing gas at $5.55 a gallon with the word cash in small letters. But use a credit card at Sinclair Gas and Scripps Ranch, and it's a big difference. It definitely suckers you if you don't look closely, so, but you gotta fill up, you gotta fill up. Ryan Donnelly filled up with diesel, which is 30 cents more a gallon. Regular unleaded is 40 cents more. But don't use trickery and, and don't use uh, misinformation. Former city attorney Mike Aguirre calls this station's actions ridiculous, saying they know people are struggling with higher gas prices and are luring them in with the hope that they don't notice the price difference. Some people might not even realize it until they've already, you know, uh, put the gas in the, in the tank. Employees declined to talk on camera, but defended the move, saying their credit price is similar to other stations in the area, and they're simply offering a huge discount for cash. But Aguirre calls that absurd because the station charges debit cards at the pump the same price as credit. We always know cash is king, but a debit card is cash. You know, and the person could go in, if they knew that, they could just go in and get, use their debit card to get cash and come back and just play cash. So. That seems like that to me is even a, a more egregious. The station does have one sign that flashes the credit price, but it's only up half as long as the cash price. So customers like Illy Zarek totally missed it. I know, and I don't really carry a lot of cash on me, so that stinks. Aguirre hopes customers will file a complaint with the city attorney's office because just the threat of an investigation usually gets businesses to stop these types of practices. If everybody does that, you, you tear away at the very uh, social fabric that we have as a society and you destroy trust. In Scripps Ranch, Steve Price, CBS 8.